So today I'm going to show you guys how to make my homemade sausage rolls, which are quite easy. So I'm going to introduce my ingredients. I've got barbecue sauce, mixed herbs, tomato paste, maybe like a tablespoon of um, olive oil, sugar, garlic, onions, eggs, mince, flour, um, beef paste, oh sorry, beef stock, oregano, salt and pepper, sausages, so you can use whatever sausages, these are chicken and parsley, and mince. So I've got my oven obviously preheating at the moment, I've got my puff pastry thawing out, so what we're going to do is pretty much shove all these ingredients into a bowl. So I'm just going to put one egg because I need to use the other egg to, um, what's it called? Um, egg wash it. So I'm just taking all the sausages out of the casing. So you can use whatever sausages you want. You can use like honey sausages, whatever, whatever you like. So I'm just going to take them out in there. So this is going to get messy. I don't know how my white shirt's going to go, but hey, we'll give it a go. So I'm just going to get all the sausages out of the casings like that. Oh, good. So that's done, just roughly. And then I'm going to put all my other ingredients into this bowl. So it's quite easy, just shove it all in, like I'm estimationing. Okay, so I've just shoved everything in there. Like it's pretty easy. I don't really like measure, so I just guesstimate. Um, so the reason why I put sugar in that is because the tomato paste is like really, really tangy. And um, so I like to sort of Get rid of that. Oh God. Whatever. Salt and pepper. Um, oregano. I'm just going to do this really quick because nobody's got time really to cook. Mixed herbs and barbecue sauce. So you can use barbecue sauce or tomato sauce, whichever. So, oh, my shirt's not even dirty yet. So winning. Um, so, and then also flour. So I put flour in there just so it combines all that mixture together. And that's it. So I'm going to just give this a good mix and um, we'll start rolling. Okay, so now this is the dirty part. Everyone likes to get nice and dirty. Um, so I'm just going to squish all this in here so it's all combined. It's not, there's nothing um, clean about this or nothing attractive about me doing that apart from the nose. <laughs> so I'm just going to mush all that together. So that should be good. That should be all done. So that's the consistency that we want. I've just let this puff pastry sort of um, melt a little bit, or should I say thawed out. It's cold here, so it's going to take a little bit longer. So then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to wash my hands, and I'm going to crack the egg, and we're going to start rolling. So now I'm just going to roll um, my sausage rolls. So don't make, like when you do them, try not to compact it too much because it will expand when it cooks. So I'm just going to do those ones probably about that size and don't put them on the edges because you're going to, we're going to seal them. So this is going to be a small skinny sausage roll. Kids love these for school. So I'm just going to roll it like that and then I'm just going to get a knife and I'm just going to cut that. So I probably could do another sausage roll there if I'm lucky. So that's done. Probably going to scratch the bejesus off my bench, but I will. And then we're just going to grab our fork and we're just going to squash those corners down. And we're going to poke a few holes in there, just like that, just so it breathes, so it doesn't like explode while it's in the oven. So that's done. I'm going to put egg wash on it. So I'm going to continue on to do the rest of these and then we're going to put them in the oven. So I've done that now. I'm just doing two for the minute. I'm just going to crack an egg. I actually don't have one of those egg brushes because I'm actually not really prepared to make this. This, is, this isn't my house. But anyway, so um, I'm just going to dip, use improvise and just use a paper towel. And we're just going to egg wash that. Like that. So once that's cooked, I'm going to put it in the oven for about, say, 45. But just keep an eye on that. And then once that's done, then I can cut them really cute. So my sausage rolls are done. I've had them in the oven for about half an hour. So they look really good. So I'm just going to cut them. Um, so I'm just going to use the bread knife because, you know, you don't want to squash that. Ooh. Look at all the, look at all the crunchy. Yum. Sausage rolls are done. Yum. It smells really, really good. 
And that is my sausage rolls. I did make two little ones for the kids though, but I think they're way too big, so I'm just going to cut them in half. Yum! 